Hello, hello with the Armageddon report. We've got a slight risk of severe thunderstorms today. In certain areas, of course, it's not like it's across the entire United States, but first earthquakes. Well, the most recent one was in Nevada, right at 1.9. Strongest earthquake, offshore Chiapas, Mexico, with 5.3. For the most part, this one was felt fairly lightly, looks like, but there was a Max CDI report. See, six responses in four cities, that's not a whole bunch of responses in moderate shaking very light damage so considering it was the strongest earthquake of the day that's pretty decent i think decent ish high temperatures today looks all right i don't know low temperatures overnight looks colder as the lows often are colder than the highs that's why they're called that active weather thing set winter weather advisory We've got winter storm watch, winter storm warning, high wind watch. I know this because I already clicked on them and memorized them. Right, red flag warning. And of course, this one I couldn't figure out. What is it? High wind warning, most likely. There's a whole bunch of wind related colors. And then there is a severe thunderstorm watch already. Today's national forecast chart is quite cluttered with all kinds of colors and things going on. So heavy snow possible in the white hatched areas, wherever they may be. There's a whole bunch of swirling going on. Uh, there's going to be a large L out, out there. If you look up in the sky, you will see a large L. I don't know. So there's thunderstorms possible there, but we'll look at a less cluttered map soon. Tomorrow, heavy snow possible in these areas. Day after tomorrow's up there again with the heavy snow possible. Here is the uh, HPC composite chart. So at least four inches of snow accumulation, at least eight, at least a foot. So high probability in several different areas of at least four and a tiny little area up there of at least eight. And it looks like slight risk of 12 inches is the largest, the highest potential. I'm not sure. What is the term under G? Right here, severe thunderstorm watch. Issued relatively recently or something. If for Kansas and Oklahoma, expires at, uh, if you can't read, it expires at 10 p.m., right. But check that out, it's got some lines of thunderstorms initiating. Is that the terminology? I do not know. Anyway, so here's the slight risk area. We've got some rain apparently up there, right up. So, specific probability of severe wind, 15%. Hail, hail no. It extends a little bit farther east, apparently, and then 5% chance of a tornado. And I should note, I think this is the farthest north I've seen this so far this season, because most of uh, the tornado stuff, you know, hanging out in the southern states. So what's up with that? Is winter over? I should, like, go ask someone who would actually know. Tomorrow, nothing. Yeah, so back to nothing again, because that's what winter does to you. Sometimes you have stuff going on, then the very next day, absolutely nothing. So not even a thunderstorm, apparently. But we'll keep an eye on it anyway, at Wicked Wicks. It's W-I-C-K-E-D-W-X dot com. And of course, there is actually stuff going on today in certain areas, so you should totally go hang out and look at the map or something, I don't know. And if you're in the affected area, turn on your weather radio if it's... And, and if you're turning it on, why was it off in the first place? Anyway, enjoy the day.